Hi everybody, I am back and I have another little bit of hauls. It's Walmart, one of them from ages ago, Dollar Tree, and hmm, Joann's. I think I have a, oh yeah, there it is, okay. So let me do the Walmart from ages ago because I don't, I don't think I showed you this stuff. It's really not that much, but um, I got this thing and it's an expanding file and it's plastic, but I got it to try and figure out how to make one out of paper. <laughs> so that is an inspiration. I got more of this size bubble mailers. Just, this is more like necessity stuff or clearance stuff. These I got on clearance. I don't think I showed these to you, but if I did, I apologize. They were a dollar each in the clearance and they're um, one inch. They're the, I don't know what size these are. What does it say? It just says one inch mini durable um, view. It has a view thing. I like that because I can put a cover in. So anyway, I got those. I guess binders are not in anymore. And they were all in the clearance. I got these, which do not have the bubble stuff in them. And then also in the clearance, they had these binder sets. And I got three of them for 50 cents each. And they're the ones I got are the lines, but they have tabs in them. And the tabs say like enjoy today have fun make it happen love life be bold um take the risk this one's grid take the risk pineapples progress not perfection butterflies and focus 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 you know i know you can't see those you still can't see those and then this is the same as the first one with the lines with five tabs. So I figured I could either use them in one of these binders or for something, which I don't know yet what, or I can use them in my planner, which is going to be the Stampin' Up! planner next year that I had bought on clearance. So um, I don't know. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to use these for, but I have them. So they're here. <laughs> Yeah, I love binders and paper. Have I ever mentioned that before? So that was the first Walmart haul. And that haul, and that's from a couple weeks ago, actually. I just forgot to show it. And then recently I was in Walmart and I went a little wacky wild. Um, I think this was there. Mm. Hang on. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure. I found these stencils. These were over... Like they were along the wall. Um, so party favors. These were where the little kid party favors are. But they're stencils. Tracing strips. And there's there's 10 of them in here with different shapes. So this one looks like seashells and stuff. I haven't opened them. Let's open them and see what they have. Um, scissors. I kind of rearranged some stuff here. And I don't know. You know I'm going to open this end. So let's see what the shapes are. But I thought they'd be good for mixed media, right? And they weren't that much, unfortunately. Let's see if I have the receipt in here. I thought I did, but maybe I took it out. Yeah, I took it out. So I don't know how much these were anymore. But they weren't terribly much or I wouldn't have got them. So yeah, this has like a whale and a dolphin and a seahorse and like waves and a fish. No, that's a sea turtle. And a starfish and a, like a little clamshell and another kind of fish and I don't know what that is but anyway those would be those would be good right um, I'm trying to see if I have a white piece of paper these are actually shipping labels I picked up from the post office this one is like um, a little train I think yeah train it has little wheels here so there's the caboose and the different train cars, the coal car, and I guess this is the engine down here. And then, okay, we have another C one. So I guess there's two of each kind. This one is flowers and stuff. Here's another train one. And then there's two um, dinosaurs. Oh, that's cute. And then these are, what are these? It's a bow, so butterflies 
Let's see. Two butterflies. There's a butterfly. I guess that's a like a there's a butterfly, right? Looks like a bow, but it's a butterfly. Here's a butterfly, both sides. Here's one, and here's one. So four butterflies. Okay, so I can share one of these with one of my grand girls, one set, and then or both of them. And then I can keep a set for me to use. I don't know, the dinosaurs are the only ones that I don't know that any of us will probably use unless I um, well, maybe I'll keep it because the neighbor next door is going to have a little boy in December. So maybe I can make a birthday card or something with it for, for that little boy. So that's that one. Oops. And then these are also stencils I found. They're called from Pen and Gear. Eight stencils. And it shows you, but I'm going to take them out because you'll never be able to see them. They're, I don't know. I'm really getting into stencils. I need to use them more. But um, I'm really liking stencils and stuff. And anyway, and I have probably enough now. So this is a birthday one. Well, it's different ones. Celebrate, love, thoughts, get it girl, today's plan, dreams, and then just some symbols and stuff. And like a snowflake. And then this one. It's got like a happy face in a um, speech bubble, a phone being held, stars and stuff. These would be good for, like here's something pointing to a heart, pointing to a star. I guess you could put like your star numbers down here, which I turned it over and now it's backwards. Emojis, unhappy and happy, person with a speech bubble. Yeah. So they're kind of generic. Um, here, I like these. These are like border ones with a bow, and then these are butterflies. These scallopy ones, like, and here. And just really pretty. These would be cool. These would be all right on cards. And here we have sailboats and like modes of transportation and things that looks like. And then here you have envelope, phone, transportation, communication. This is like a tab, a clock, or a compass, I'm sorry. And a hot air balloon, a light bulb, handshake. Some of them I probably won't use. Some flags, a trophy, one of those like megaphone things, music note. And this was, you know, not that much, I don't think, because I, I probably wouldn't buy it if it was too much. Bowling, this is sports and stuff. Here's a picket fence and a leaf and a heart, and I don't know what that is, a balloon maybe. Football, soccer balls, baseballs, umbrella. Here's weather. You know, these two lines are weather. And then we have ABCs and symbols. And then here, we've got three more. We've got different like starbursts and things. And here we've got like an arrow pattern. And then there's arrows down here. And these are numbered at the top, I just noticed. So this is number seven out of eight. Some flowers, hot air balloons, some pennants, and some like labels and other miscellaneous shapes. And this one is eight. And it's got some decorative things again, like almost like fleur de lis and scrolls. And so yeah, I got that pack of stencils. Let's see which way they go here. Six. Nope, it doesn't go like that. That is backwards, so it has to go like this. Shiny side up. Shiny side up. There we go. Getting it under control here. <laughs> Four. Three. Two. One. All right. So that is the stencils, and then um, I went a little hog wild in the in the ribbon area. They had these. I think they were a dollar ninety nine. Because I don't usually get the ones that were super expensive. These were actually on an end cap that had to do with breast cancer awareness month and. 
I think they were um, getting, you know, trying to sort of close them out before they went in clearance. So a real sparkly pink. I don't have a lot of pale pink ribbon, amazingly. I have some raffia and stuff, but I don't have much pale pink. And then in the sewing area, they have um, they have these goodies, right? So I got white bows. Red poinsettias, these white, um, now these were a little much, I think they were $2.99 and three, this one might have been more, like a $3.49 or something, um, and these, I got two of these, hang on, and then these red bows, so I got bows in white and red and um these flowers and then these like poinsettia shaped flowers okay and then in the button area i got these gear ones and i think i might already have them but i don't think these actually have um button backs they don't so these are metal gears and they weren't that much either so i'm like thinking a dollar 99 for them or something and then these are snowflakes but usually they have the the loop on the back but these don't these have two holes in them so you can sew them on to stuff and uh, it says sew on gems and they weren't that much and they're kind of plain on one side but the other side is very sparkly and shiny like a clear on it so i got those and then these were all 90 98 cents i think these gemstones so i got gold silver pink i got two pinks one is probably going to be in a giveaway and red so yeah that was my walmart haul let me figure out i'm just going to shove that to the back because i got to put all this stuff away then i went to dollar tree recently 108 yes dollar tree hmm i went in to get some things from mom and came out with way too much so I did get napkins for Thanksgiving because, as it turns out, I'm having Thanksgiving here at my house. And we're going to have four, five, six, seven, eight people, including me and Christopher, in my little house, which is a lot. And my house is a mess, so I have a lot of work to do. Anyway, um, and then I did get a monthly planner for a dollar. It's only the month. And... Um, I think I'm going to use this instead of my planner and instead of printing off of the website to do my YouTube tracking and stuff for my collabs and such. So that's why I got this to track my collabs and it does have the holidays and things in it. So I'm going to use my um, Stampin' Up! planner for everything else, but I think I want to use just the monthly in here. To, because the monthly in my Stampin' Up! planner is small and I was going to be printing uh, but I think I'll just keep this with you know printing out sheets like these but I like that they have lines on them as well so it makes it easier for me who writes crooked and stuff to write in it and there's a place for notes so like I said it's just the monthly and that is perfect for doing my I'm going to be joining in the collab next year with um, cakes and crafts or something like that with Amalia Amalia hi Amalia um, so yeah so I'm going to use this to track that okay and then I think it's cool cakes and crafts with Amalia and then I got these two they were the only two they had they're called pocket folders and I just really liked how they were they have a pocket here and then they have multiple pockets here in uh, like a film purple orange pink um, and then a pink one over here and they're like a vinyl and they do fit in a big binder but I'm not gonna do it that way and then also these were the last two of these also in pink um, and they're a folder with a zip pouch on them I had never seen these there before. This was not my usual um, Dollar Tree, so those are cool. So I got them, and um, I think I'm going to be using them for, for happy mail, friend mail kind of stuff. And then I did get one pack of, of stickers. Ugh, yes, I know. I don't think I have this one, and I thought it was beautiful. So yes, I got it. Okay, now that's not all. 
sadly that's not all um they didn't you know my, this store that i was at they didn't have a lot in the in the christmas area i did get this roller ribbon with the christmas poinsettias on and i did get this um believe one in like a silvery blue with snowflakes on which i thought was pretty and i think that's all i got out of the holiday stuff but then i went to the floral area and they haven't had these colors to my knowledge in two strand here so i got pink and green and i believe i got two of those but one of them is going to be a giveaway i mean a friend mail sorry and then they had this sheer in like a real pretty lilac it doesn't have a color on it you get six yards and that was pretty good it's uh it's polyester but i don't know it just shows sheer ribbon and but they also had this sparkly in the pinky purple and this lacy one in, in a lilac and I thought that was really pretty. I had never seen that lace ribbon in lilac before there at Dollar Tree. I think I have seen the sparkly, but I don't have it in this color. It's like a pinky purple, almost like Stampin' Up's Purple Posy, right? And then I got two of these dark green sheer ribbons. I thought they'd be nice for my Christmas projects. There's only 18 feet. Well, let's see. So that's... Three, six, nine, twelve. That's five yards too. Um, so yeah. And then the last thing I got at Dollar Tree is this burlap ribbon with the white lace on because when I alter composition books and stuff, I like to put or other books, I like to put a binding on and it. it's nice and wide. And then this would be right at the the black part of the composition book binding and these would go over the back so i i think that'll be pretty on a comp book altered altered maybe for the spring or something i don't know or fall that's it guys that is my that's the end of my haul so i hope you enjoyed that and let me know what you liked the most or if you didn't like anything let me know that too but um would you have gotten any of these things i don't know let me know these I know I can use for Christmas. It's a sheer ribbon, um, so I'll be using those. And then, like I said, one each of these will be given away. And um, these I can use for Christmas too. So I, I have these for Christmas. And um, I haven't gotten much for Christmas. And some red adhesive dots. And so these will be friend mail. And the pink gemstone will be friend mail. And now I have other pink ribbons also from Walmart. So I'm set on my pinks and my greens. So yeah. All right. Hey guys, I forgot to do the Joann's part of this haul. So all their paper pads and stuff were 50% off. And no, I didn't go hog wild. I did, however, get this one. But now the, when I got it home, I'm like, I need to check. I might already have this. And if I do, this will go in a future giveaway. All right. Um, so this is Moonstruck by Pink Paisley. The name of it sounds familiar. I don't know if I have this or not. And if I do, like I said, it'll go in a giveaway. Look at all these little tiny squares. Believe in magic. Happiest with you. We are the luckiest. Hello, lovely. Blossom and bloom, create the life you love, timeless moments, make it happen, shine bright. These would be cute in a planner, actually. This is beautiful. Isn't this beautiful? I do not remember this paper, but that doesn't mean anything. This has, like, script in the background on watercolor. This is feathers. This is, like, doilies almost all over, tone-on-tone -tone kind of thing. I don't know if you can see them. There we go. And this kind of funky houndstoothy kind of print. It's got stripes and these boxes that are on an angle. This one does have a subtle background. I don't uh, pattern. I don't know if you can see it. It's hard to determine what that is. And then just uh, black, gray, and white. Pink roses. Pretty, pretty. Pink with that same pattern. Maybe you can see it better. I don't know maybe not there 
It's sort of like lines with little tiny star starbursts or something in them. A gray script. This one. It does not look like anything's repeating here. Black and white floral. Just pink. This is like um, diamond, uh, little faint diamond lines. There you can see that. The moon phases. That would be good for Moonstruck. They should have more than one of those in the pad. This design, very neutral. These are a little bit bigger. I love the keys one. Hello, love. I love you to the moon and back. Tray chic. Daydreams and grand. Uh, I cannot read that. Schemes, grand, daydreams and grand schemes. All the good, wonderful, lovely, spectacular vibes. Dream big. And this one is life is more beautiful with you. So those are what's in the cut of parts. Ooh, that's pretty. Beautiful. And there's your keys. This one I don't really care for. It's not the pattern. It's the colors together. I don't really like that much. Oof. And they did put another one of these in. Some more hearts. That looks like the sky, only pink, burgundy, pink and burgundy butterflies. Okay, so they have two of these in here and two of these. So there are a couple repeats, but not all feathers. And that's it. So it says 36 sheets. It doesn't say like X amount of two or whatever. And they're single-sided. Yep, so I got that. And I think the only other paper I got for me was these. I bought two single sheets of this color because uh, it was on sale. And it's called Sparkling Water. G something, G Silk Sparkling Water. I don't know who makes it but it's really pretty and it is it doesn't seem to rub off which i love so i did get that for winter stuff right and then i visited uh well before i get into what who i visited i did get i was looking for faber -Tac and they had it but it was way too much money and i didn't have another coupon so i got this fabric fusion in almost like a pen style permanent fabric adhesive um, if anybody else has used this, let me know if you like it or not. I don't know. I've never tried it. So I got that. And then I got this on with my coupon. It's a hero arts. It says peace, prayers for peace, wishing you peace to you and your family this Christmas, love and joy. So peace, love and joy. I like that. Peace be with you. I like that too. Peace on earth goodwill toward all instead of goodwill towards men and I like that too so that I did get with um, actually I think these were all whoops these were all 40% off that's what I think it was and I thought I kept the receiving here this I was not on sale this was $5.99 I wanted they have seasonal books now the thick books but they were not on sale I missed it they were last week on sale so I did get this, just this Christmas one. It's all Christmas stickers, merry and bright, and kind of shows you here what they are. I don't know if you can tell, I don't want to open it. I like the nutcrackers. It's more images than words. Sorry for my phone. And then I got a bunch of stuff from Ms. Sparkle and Company. And some of it will be giveaways and some, I mean, um, friend mail and some will not. I got, I think I have these, so if I do, they're a giveaway. I like these sparkly hearts and I got them in clear and in red for Valentine's Day, right? I got these and these I might be keeping or I might give one away of. And then these are for happy mail. Um, a balloon with um, birthday sentiment that stamps and a balloon die this one is a banner and it says thanks a bunch hello friend love miss sending happy thoughts sending hugs and kisses and then like a leaf thing and this is, says you so you can say hello you miss you love you sending you 
happy thoughts kind of thing. Uh, these are just stamps. Happy birthday stamps. They're more birthday. I like the larger font as well. And then this is butterflies and birds and um, just a little note and thinking of you. So these, like I said, will be going in friend mail. And these will also be going in friend mail. Oh, I don't know how that got ripped. It ripped in the bag, I think. It's just the cover. But this craft paper, I already have this. And it's fine. It's a, it's a heavy craft paper. Um, and that would be nice for cards and stuff. And I got this one called Clouds and Grass, which I think is really pretty. This is a thinner paper, but that could be used as cards on cards also. I got um, the Brights. I got um, paper white and 15 sheets. And it's, um, it's probably about 65 pounds. It's like the Michaels sheets almost. And I'm thinking these will be too. I don't know. Um, so I got those 15 sheets, three of each of these colors. And then to go with them, I also got this one, which is a floral paper. So these were not on sale, but they were $1.99 each. You know, Miss Sparkle and Co. is. And all these and this are going in a friend mail package. And I'm not sure about, I think probably these stars will too. Um, because I think I have them. I have to check. But if I don't, I'll, I'll keep them and the rest of the stuff that will go in friend mail. So that's it. That's my haul. Thanks for watching. Hugs, love, and peace. Have a great day.